All right, this is my audience of three. So my name is Olivia Fector, and I want to start off my demonstration speech with a famous quote by Jimmy Buffett, which is, when life gives you limes, make margaritas. So have you ever had a stressful week of school or class and needed something to unwind? Well, I have, for sure. Um, I am going to teach everyone three simple steps of how to make a non-alcoholic margarita. I chose to make a non-alcoholic margarita because I wanted to include the audience of people who just don't enjoy the taste of alcohol. So the first step of the three is we need to assemble our supplies. So you need two glasses, one for mixing and one for your final product. You need three limes, which we have. We have one orange and we have already portioned out three, um, two ounces of sweet and sour mix and um, an ounce of orange juice, which you can choose any brand, whatever you like. And we have margarita salt and you will need ice. Um, so after you have assembled your supplies, the second step you will do is mix and blend your ingredients together. So you're going to take two limes and you're going to squeeze them into your glass. And you want to save one of your limes so you can garnish your glass at the end. After you squeeze your two limes, you're going to squeeze your orange slice. And you can either keep your fruit in your glass or you can discard it. Just if you want to keep it in there, it can add extra flavor or you can discard it. I discard it because I'm not a fan of pulp. So you are going to next add your two ounces of sweet and sour mix. After that, you will add your ounce of orange juice. And if you are 21 and older, this is where you would add two ounces of your favorite tequila or and an, uh, half an ounce of triple sec. But like I said, make sure you are 21 and over. So we are going to um, set this drink aside to just let all the ingredients blend together and muddle. So since you, so for the third step, we are going to create our final product glass and pour the mixture inside. So since you have saved your varnish line, you are going to rim the outside of your glass and make sure you do not throw it away because like I said, you will garnish it at the end of your drink. You're gonna take your glass and dip it in the salt and this can be optional just in case like some people just aren't fans of salty things but classic margaritas usually have them next you are going to add your mixture that you let blend and muddle together and then you are going to add your ice And the final step you are going to do is you're going to garnish it. And I always like to choose a fun, exciting glass because you always want to please your audience and make everything fun and exciting. And this is what you can enjoy. It's very refreshing. So let's review the steps that we just went over. The first step is assemble all your supplies, which is two glasses, one for mixing and one for your final product, three limes, one orange, two ounces of simple, I mean, of sweet and sour mix, an ounce of orange juice, ice, and margarita salt, which is optional. The second step is you blend and mix all your ingredients together. And you make sure you let that all blend together so you get a great taste. And the third step we did was we created our final product and we chose a cute, simple, classy glass and we poured the mixture inside. Um, I have been a bartender for two years now and I hope I showed everybody something that I love to do and y'all can love this drink as well. It's a fun way to bring friends together or like I said, just unwind after having a bad day of class or work. Um, like I said, this is a non-alcoholic drink. So if you do choose to add alcohol, like I said, make sure you are 21 and older and you drink responsibly. And I hope y'all enjoy. Thank you.
All right, audience. <laughs> Thank y'all.